My name is Jeanette Smith and I'm in Human Resources with the Archdiocese and part of that role is the Responsible Ministry Protocol Coordinator for the Archdiocese. Responsible Ministry Protocol in, in what, uh, 30 words or less is um, it's the policies and procedures that we have that, that govern us in protecting our youth, our children, and vulnerable adults in everything we do within the Archdiocese. For chaperones, group leaders, uh, volunteers that are, uh, that are coming to Steubenville, what we ask is that because they'll be dealing with our youth and vulnerable adults, that uh, we ask them to also comply with the Responsible Ministry Protocol. So if, if we have uh, volunteers, chaperones, um, group leaders that are coming from within the Archdiocese of Halifax, Yarmouth, we ask them to complete the information sheet, which also has references attached to it. We ask them to read and sign the Covenant of Care and we ask them to uh, provide us with a criminal record check and a vulnerable sector search. And all of these documents are on the website or they can contact me or their parish coordinator to receive any of these documents. If you're external to the Archdiocese of Halifax, Yarmouth, so this would include anybody that's coming from uh, the Atlantic provinces, the other Atlantic provinces from uh, anywhere in the U.S. or even from uh, the Diocese of Anaganish. Um, they would need to provide the information sheet, the covenant of care, and what we call a certificate of approval. So it, it's a, it's a one-page document that they would have their parish or someone from the Archdiocese complete and send to us. So we're not asking them to provide a criminal record check or a vulnerable sector search. We try to make it as easy as possible for people to get these documents completed. Well, the, the protocol is, uh, the, the full protocol, it's a long document, it's 65 pages and it's on the website. And I don't expect everyone to read it cover to cover. There's a lot of things in there that, that uh, only relate to certain groups. The most important part, I think, for, uh, for our volunteers, for our chaperones, for our uh, group leaders, is the covenant of care. And that's on page seven and eight of the protocol. And it's uh, a number of bullet points. And when you start looking at that, you, you shake your head and, and you think, uh, this is common sense. It's things that you've been told for years, things like um, you shouldn't be alone with, uh, with a youth or a, a vulnerable adult, that you, need to, that you need to have other people with you, um, that you shouldn't, be ta you shouldn't take pictures of, uh, of our children in, or youth in a uh, compromising situation, which would be while they're dressing or undressing, um, that we, we don't administer drugs, we don't provide alcohol. Um, we're, as a, as a group leader, as a chaperone, as a volunteer, we're there to make this whole Steubenville experience a, a wonderful, faith-filled experience for our youth. And so uh, we try to do everything we can to make that a good experience. And the protocol just is, is in the background, just kind of sitting on our shoulder, um, reminding us of, of things that, uh, that we need to do or not do. If, uh, if we have um, these volunteers that have participated in Steubenville in the past and have completed this documentation in the past, if it's within, uh, if you're outside of the Archdiocese and you've completed it within one year, then you won't need to complete it again. 
if you if, if it's older than a year, then we will ask you to do it again. Uh, for internal to the archdiocese, if you've completed it within the last three years, then you don't need to do it again. So and and we'll do everything we can to help make it as easy as possible. And one of the things that we've done lately is that we have the criminal record check and vulnerable sector search now available online. And that is, uh, it, it's wonderful because it, it takes 24 hours or less for most people to, uh, to get it completed and into us. So it's very quick.